Yo! What's up, guys? It's me. Back here in good old Azeroth, baby. That's right, we're back. And when I'm saying we're back, it's because we played Maple Worlds yesterday. And, you know, um, I'm not gonna lie. It might be my next addiction. I'm, I'm, I, I, think, I think it got me, guys. I think it got me. I was- I talked a little bit of smack to Maple Worlds, but honestly, I think I'm gonna- I'm gonna take it back. I'm gonna take it back. It's alright. I thought it was gonna fail hard, but I think it's gonna- I think it's- I think it's got room to grow. I think it's got room to succeed. Um, but we're not talking about Maple Story today. We're gonna be talking about World of Warcraft today, because guys, we got- we got my WoW viewers here. I haven't forgotten about you guys, alright? We don't just switch up on you guys like that, alright? At the B variety. I'm here for- I'm here for you till the end, baby. Alright. <laughs> but guys, we were in the last video in Deep Home. Um, obviously we're not in Deep Home because it's the Hallowed's Eve event in Azeroth. Halloween! Woo! Spooky season, guys! Let's go! So, we're gonna be starting the video off doing the Hallow's Weave uh, event or whatever it's called. And then we'll end off doing uh, questing in Deep Home. Uh, this video is gonna be not too long because I gotta. I, we're gonna be starting to do a bunch of double uploads, guys. So wow and Maple, wow and Maple, because the first official American old school Maple Story server is out today, guys. Our Tail MS. Um, it is a more like a. Um, it's like a more modern take on old school Maple Story, where it's like you know increased rates, um, increased all that stuff, making it a lot easier. Um, and Maple Land, which is like the hardcore, like classic um, Maple Story, old, old school Maple Story. Um, that one is actually not out yet. I'm gonna be playing that one because I wanna, um, um, you know, I just want that like. I want that old school, old school experience, baby. And I heard that our tales uh, coding was wasn't as good as Maple Land, so Maple Land is the more refined version. Um, not no hate to our tail. Go support both of them. But um, yeah, we're gonna be flipping double uploading, guys. So let's flip and go. All right, guys. So we're we're back here in the wows of Wowcraft, all right, guys, and it's the Hollow's Eve event. What's it called? Hollow's End event. Hollow's End celebrates the break of the Forsaken from the Scourge. Wow, fun and mischief reigns as the innkeepers of Azeroth give treats and tricks to whomever asks. Begins 1018, ends 1101. Okay, so let's get our let's get our event in, cause you know there's um. A mount that you can get from this dude this mount looks sick. What is this lava Drake? What the heck? But there is a mount that you can get there's like, you know cool little head pieces You got the pumpkin head right there. I think there's like some weapons you can get so a lot of great stuff that you can do uh, You can acquire from the Hallowed's event. Let's start by talking to the uh, the orc commoner Let's see what let's see what's going on over with this guy Let's see what's going on with this guy The forsaken are right to celebrate Wait, am I recording? Okay, I am the Forsaken are right to celebrate their freedom. What else is more important? Masked Orphan Matron? Strength. For Hollow's End, Orc orphans were taken on a trip to many Horde villages. The Orphan Matrons thought it would be good for them to see real heroes adventuring in the field. Why don't you visit them? A brave shaman like yourself could strengthen their spirits with tales of your valor. Go to either Razor Hill and Duratar, Brill and Trisful Glades, or Falcon Wing Square in Eversong Forest. Speak with the masked orphan matron and she'll introduce you to the children. Um, sure, why not? Uh, okay. A season for celebration. Well, well met, Shaman. Hollow's End is a time for celebration and reflection, uh, though some have no idea why. The burning of the Wicker Man in particular is a mystery to many outside the Forsaken. Travel to the ruins of Lordaeron above Undercity and speak to Darkcaller Yanka. She can tell you more about the Wicker Man ceremony. Okay, so we have to go to the Undercity, learn more about the Forsaken, and you know why they celebrate Hollow Zen. Oh, and there's actually a treat, Hollow Zen treats. 
So we got a little um, candies. Oh, this is nice. You know, I like this. I like this. It's like a nice little role playing. Some great. If you want some candy, you know, you can grab some candy. What's there to do in Hollow's End? What isn't there to do, you mean? Each of the innkeepers throughout the world are handing out trick-or-treat goodies, and many of the towns are decorated for the season. Also, there is the Wicker Man Festival just outside the Undercity during the evenings. Well, we're about to go there now. Um, Rachel Gothena. Oh, and look what we have here, my friends. Look what we have here. We have a little apple bob. I'm gonna use this. Yoink! We get an apple. What is this? Restore 3% of your health and mana per second for 25 seconds. Must remain seated while eating. Does it, like, do anything? Like, anything special besides just giving you HP and mana? Okay, so it just gives you, like, a lot of HP and mana. That's cool. Let's check out this quest, the candy bucket. Candy buckets like this are located in inns throughout the realms. Go ahead, take some. Trick or treat! Receive a handful of candy from one of the candy buckets. Okay. And then we got it right here. Handful of treats. Troll mail mask. Fire. Oh, yeah. We're putting this on. Oh, yeah, baby. Look at us. Dude, we're freaking Halloweened out. It's spoopy season. All right, guys? It's spoopy season. Ugh. What else did we get? We got mail. You got mail. No, what do we get? Tricky treat? Where is this? Am I blind? Oh, it's right here. Uh, let's use it. Increase speed by 4%. Whoa, that's cool. Okay, so they give you like buffs and stuff. That's sweet. Alright, here we got another quest for Hollow's Eve, Hollow's End. Missing heirlooms. I told that courier to take the Zeppelin, but no, he had to use the Goblin Ship. Well, now he's late and my precious family heirloom are with him. If you're willing to help, would you go down to the docks east of Ogremar behind, uh, aboard the Goblin Ship and see what's keeping him? Uh, for 31 gold, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Alright, guys. <sighs> Definitely, without a doubt. Is that all the quests, though? I know that there's a dungeon here, so we got the Headless Ghost Dungeon. Cue for the Headless Horseman Battle. Uh, we'll do that, um... We'll do that now, why not, right? Why not, right? Th that might be the thumbnail. It might be the thumbnail for the Hollow's End. Ooh, and look at this! We got, like, a little ghost here. Spooky. Ghost, we got some pumpkins. Dude, this is absolutely fire. So, wait, 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 what am I supposed to do? Uh, close, oh, no, no, close this, 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 ship at the docks east of Ogremar, so we just search the courier's cabin, right, yeah, it should be at the Bladefist Bay, ooh, I think that's it right there, I think we have to go to the goblin ship, right, where we came from? So we gotta find this dude's heirloom. And we're queued up, by the way, for the Headless Horseman. I don't know what this is. I've never done this before. So, excuse any newbiness. What the fudge? Bro, why did my just, like, flying mount just get absolutely just shot out of the sky? Look at This guy's the same thing. He can't fly either. Bro, it's cooked right now. This guy literally went through the same problem as me. I can't fly either. What? Bro, this is cooked. Oh, we got it. All right, let's see what let's see what this is. If it's anything like <laughs> If it's anything like the the um the dire the um brew fest, it should be easy, all right? Yeah, you just like come here, kill a boss, and then that's it. Horsemen rise. Your time is nigh. You felt death once. Now, no demise! Let fate choose now. A righteous one. 
Ooh. Oh, we get the headless horseman, guys. Oh, I'm so scared. I'm not. I'm not. We're good. Uh, we do this, this. Oh my god, I don't have my freaking buffs on. Okay, and then, yeah, you just fight a boss. Just very similar to um, Dire Brew. Core and Dire Brew quest. Um, you're just a tank and spank. It's not that hard. Wow. I was expecting maybe like a little bit of difficulty. At least with Dire Brew, he summoned like mobs and stuff. Oh, okay, never mind. He's got a phase two. Oh, his head pops off. You gotta kill the head now. Can't click it. Oh my god, he's got another life. Oh shoot, okay. Yo, dude's out here freaking spitting bars right now. Someone's gotta sign this man. Someone need to sign this man. Feel the burn. Ooh, yeah, this guy's pissed right now. He's pissed. So this is the Hollow's End event, guys. This is the um, boss here. He's gonna drop equipment, potentially. Uh, oh my god, oh my god, please. Oh, we gotta find the head. We gotta fight the head. Oh, there we go. Now we can target the head. Yo, how many times do we have to kill this guy, man? Is this guy like, this guy's like invincible or some shit. Just gonna AoE these guys down. I don't know if we sh should, but we're gonna do it anyways. Alright, come on. I'm feeling like this is the end. Oh my god, his head. Oh, we gotta wait till we kill his head, I feel like. I see. Ah, yeah, okay, that makes sense. Ooh! Ooh, kill him! Ooh, kill him! Ooh! 365 ring, bro? I'm needing that mamma jamma. I'm needing that mamma jamma. Ah! Ah! Dude, this is gonna be a huge spike in our eye level. Holy moly, boys. Where's it at? And it's great. It's great for us too. Stamina, intellect. I don't. I don't know about stamina, but stamina's fine. Intellect, hit rating is nah. Eh. Haste is nah. Eh. It's, it's 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 okay. I, I wish we had like we can maybe reforge this. Hopefully. Oh, let's give it to this one. We only gained three item level. Is this like? Is this? Is, is, is what's going on? <laughs> Sir Thomas, who are you? Greetings. For ages I was lost. Now, finally, I see how dark my soul had become. Oh, is this the, um... Yo, is this the Headless Horseman, guys? Dude, insane, boys. Insane. Okay. That's it, guys. Uh, so, that's it. You can do it uh, however many times you want to, uh, but you won't get the daily reward, which is the, uh... Uh, where is it? Right here. Loot filled pumpkin. So let's hope and pray we get uh, the mount. Give me the mount. First T. First T. Man, get your freaky deaky out of ass out of here, boy. How do you? How do you have real estate in my head right now? What the fuck? Oh, he, we're on the boat. <clears throat> Yo, I'm getting kind of spooked out right now. Am I possessified right now? She. Yo, this guy got that. Look at you. You see this guy? Yo, dude got the sword through the back of the through the back. Got in that back shots right now. Yo. Dude, what if I what, what happens if I turn around? Will I see the headless horseman? Uh oh, I'm scared. I'm gonna turn around slowly. Please, no one be behind me. I think we're good. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Search the courier's cabin. Yo, dude, this guy's fried. The crate that Edgar described doesn't appear to be here. I mean, yeah, I, I, what's like, there's, at least there's a dead guy here. There's a dead guy here who has Edgar's heirloom. I'm scared, guys. Dude, this is this is not looking good. This isn't. If this is a prank, just tell me now, okay? All right. So I don't. If freaking 
explode the place with my elemental powers. Okay. I'm not afraid to use it. Is it here? I don't think so. Oh, let me let me open the let me open this. All right, fingers crossed. Mount first try for for the YouTube video for the YouTube video first T. I hate my life. I hate my life. What is this? Ooh, ooh, what is this? Ah, it's a pumpkin head. Okay, you got a torn female mask. This is great, but it's cloth. We need to find a male one so we could transmogrify it. You know? Okay, what am I supposed to do though? We already explored, we already found the guy. There's no other room to go into. But it says we have to search the courier's cabin. It says that we have to like find some sort of like a chest, it said. Yeah, this is bad. This is looking bad, guys. The courier is murdered on the goblin boat. And there's no sign of a, you know, any sort of, you know, perpetrator or whatever you want to call them. I'm spooked out, guys. I'm spooked the F out right now. Doesn't it appear to be here. I know it's not here, like, but where is it, though? Is it here? Yo, it's flipping spoopy season right now, guys. Holy. Oh, it's probably down here. No. Alright, you know what? Why don't you just jabate me more? Just keep on jabating me, asshole. Alright, I'm gonna find you, you sick son of a bitch! How could you do this? How could you do this? Yo, does this guy have a freaking desk lamp on him? What's going on? Where are we supposed to, where do we, where do we find the, how do we explore the cabin? Alright, but anyways guys, for that, um, Headless Horseman quest, uh, you want to just, um, uh, that's, that's your daily. You want to do it every day so you can get the, the mount. I'm pretty sure you get the mount from there, I, I think. Um, so you want to just keep doing it until you get the mount. You're going to eventually get it. The, the drop rate isn't too low. Um, dude, where am I supposed to go? Where's the Corvier's cabin? I, do I really have to Google this? Is this, like, for real? It should, like, auto-complete it when we walk through. Search the cabin of the hired courier ship at the docks He's for evidence of what might have happened to him. Let me ask this guy. Do you know what to do? I guess Horde don't like talking, eh? He's out. Okay, it looks like this guy just I think he's a I think he's a mute. I think he's a mute. I don't think he knows how to speak. I don't think he knows what to do. Dude, what, what, what am I supposed to do? Why does this guy have a bucket in his hand? Is he gonna say something? Maybe he will eventually. Maybe he's just a shy guy. Oh yeah, maybe he was just a little shy guy. Oh man. Yo, yo, why am I hearing like somebody in my ear right now? I did not allow this guy to just like, you know, start talking to me like that, like, bro. You're gonna have to like freaking. Ah, oh, you can't do that shit. You gotta like freaking get the freak out of my head right now. You gotta get the flip out of my head, dude. Am I really gonna have to Google this? I, I think I have to. Cause <laughs> like, I don't I don't know. Missing heirlooms. I mean, here he is. Like, here's bro. This guy's absolutely fried right now. I don't. I don't know what to do. 
Is it saying search the courier's cabin? It's saying to search the courier's cabin twice. Maybe we have to go back to Edgar? I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Maybe we do. And then mention it to him or something like that? I really don't know. Great! So, the, the Brewfest quests were bugged. Maybe Hollow's End quests are bugged. Amazing. Amazing. Oh, we also have to talk to the orphans. We gotta go show them what a real hero, who a real hero is. AKA your boy, Hello B. Dude, we could just spam Headless Horseman's dungeon. Is this unique? Yeah, it's unique equipped, so we can't get two of them. But maybe we can get like some some other great items from the horseman's um, horseman's vibes. Bro, what am I supposed to do? What is it? Why does it say do it twice? I don't I don't understand. This is so confusing. Alright, let's let's try again. I, I don't know what's going on. I think it's like maybe bugged or something. I, I don't know Okay, let's try it again. So we got the cabin All right, well uh, Let me ask bugged I just looked up on Wowhead. Someone said, "Seems to currently be bugged." Uh, October eighteenth, twenty twenty-four. Come on, man. <clears throat> Come on, man. That's so cringe, dude. How? What is this, man? You're gonna have an event and then have it be bugged on launch, bro? Where's the? Oh my god, but they didn't they didn't forget to put them freaky ass freaking freaky mother effing things and freaking intercom PA message in my ears. They didn't forget that. But they forgot to fix the dang freaking quest. I'm already disappointed. I don't know guys, it's it's bugged. This is great. This is just great. You know what? I I you know what? <clears throat> Uh, it says according to people according to someone on Wowhead, they said it's bugged and then someone else someone else responded to that guy said yep looks like it cringe absolutely cringe come on blizzard dude they what, what's up with this what's up with this shit i like wh why are people paying why are we paying $15 a month for this shit honestly like you can't even get this shit right you can't even you just have these fucking things these events that that you're supposed to that are supposed to excite the player have the player you know, get them, you know, excited about playing WoW, and then you come into this shit and it's fucking bugged. It doesn't work. Bro. Fix the fucking shit, bro. People, you're, you're taking people's money for, for this shit. Where's the money going to? I guarantee it's not going to the fucking developer who's got to fix this bug. Fucking hell, man. Excuse my language, but that pisses me off because the it, it, dude, it's it's not like a um, it's not like a one-time thing. The last event, but then they got this shit in my ear, fucking do over here is on repeat. Fucking psychopath, fucking freaking uh, Jason, freaking Freddy vs Jason type shit up in my ear, and motherfucker, they can't fix the, they can't fix the. So bad. Like, bro, what the fuck, man? Like, bl like that's that. Why is everything on fire? Is this place good? I don't even know. Like, let me continue my rant, alright? Like, it's not just a one-time thing, bro. It was literally... Dude, Brewfest came out and Brewfest was bugged on launch. You got people paying $15 a month. And obviously, it's not a lot, but like, you know, you, you add up the whole year. Maybe that's, maybe that's people's, you know, groceries or their bills, you know? It's like... 
And you can't even release an event properly. This is the second event that was bugged on launch, bro. The second event that was bugged on launch. And ain't nobody fixing this shit. It, the, the event started at 3 a.m. 4 a.m. It's freaking 4, 4.50 p.m. It's been 12 hours. No one fixed this shit. Man, that's stupid as hell, bro. I, I'm pissed. I, I wouldn't be as pissed if I didn't play Brewfest and it was bugged, but I played Brewfest and it was bugged on launch. So I, I'm pissed. The children love to watch heroes at their work. It is my hope that one day each of these orphans will grow into a strong member of the Horde and ultimately die in glorious battle. What the fudge? Yo, these kids did not just li grow up to be orphans to die like that. Die like a dog's death, man. What the fudge? Ah, uh, thoughts of a fine of such a fine fate brings mist to my eyes. Yo, this shit crazy. Stop the fires. Enjoy a tasty treat. Jam onto your head or throw it onto someone. The horde's children need you, Hella B. The headless horseman, once a human paladin, and now an insane fiend, has set fire to our village. You must put out those fires. Grab a bucket and throw it onto the blaze, or toss it to an ally who is closer to the flames. Extinguish all the fires and thwart the headless horseman. Yeah, right. Let me whisper this guy again. Tell me about what did he say? Tell me about it. Took about a week to fix that one. Yeah. Yeah. Such a shame. All right. Let's go put out some damn fires. I wanted to do the main quest, but we can't flip and do that because freaking stupid thing is bugged. Um, where's my bucket? I'm pissed, guys. I'm pissed. I'm pissed. Bro, shut up, bro. Dude, screw this freaking Ganondorf looking motherfucker. Get the freak out of my face. Goofy ass motherfucker. Get your fucking Ganondorf looking ass. I'm sick and tired of this guy, man. What the fudge? Oh my god, dude, this guy's cringe on main. He's literally cringe on main. Alright, let's go. I don't know what the fudge is going on, but we gotta like put off fires or something. Oh, we got another water bucket. People are just throwing water buckets at us. Dude, I'm just getting someone just spamming water buckets on me. Who is that? Okay, wh what am I supposed to do? Put out the fires. We did just do it. So sad and yet so true. Happy hunting out there. Uh, can we get like an unlimited amount of barrels? No, only one. Uh, sigh. You too. Okay, I don't. I don't know what we're supposed to be doing. Shit, I did not mean to press that button. Oh, well, let's put the water bucket on our hotkey right here. Okay. How many times do we have to do this? I, I, uh, I, uh. Yeah, I'm disappointed, man. I'm real disappointed. Because it's like... How can you... How are you gonna... What's next? What's gonna be bugged next? The Christmas event's gonna be bugged next? Like, come on, man. Like... Straight booty cheeks, man. Straight booty cheeks, for real. So we got the brew... We got the Brewfest quest bugged. Hollow's End quest bugged. And now it's gonna be the Christmas quest bug. That's cringe, bro. And not a single word from a GM. <clears throat> not a single word from someone to fix this shit. Absolutely crazy, man. So crazy. 
I'm just gonna toss. Oh, that's what's happening. This guy's tossing it. Yes, yeah, stay there. Stay there. We toss it to you. So, that's that, guys. This is it. Well, I like this, though. I like this. You know, we got a little bit of teamwork action going on here. We're doing the dailies together. We're having the nice hollowed eaves vent. Hollow's end event here. You know, this is what it's all about, guys. This is what all oh, this is what the this is what MMOs are all about. It's all about just having a good time with the people around you. Alright? Doing the quests together, playing the game. Um <clears throat> Yeah, I, I really like this. I, I like this. I'm just sad that the, the main quest line's bugged. It's like, oh, I'm gonna have to show you guys the. I'm gonna have to because I was gonna name this video, oh, doing the like you know, let's go to let's let's uh, celebrate Halloween, whatever, whatever, in the freaking World of Warcraft, whatever, right? Something along those lines. But you guys are gonna see this video and be like, this is janky af. Toss water bucket on five fires? What? Yeah, I think it's good. I think we're good, man. Is it good? Did we finish the daily? I'm, I'm honestly, I'm about to just quit right now. <laughs> like, seriously, like, is it? The bells have told. Your weak, your okay, the fires are gone. Each of you shall pay the final sum. Cry for mercy. The reckoning has come. Okay, dude, we got it. <laughs> Did we complete the quest? Oh, more fires. Bro, what is going on right now? Maybe we have to hear. Let, let's let's give it one more try. I'm going to give it one more chance. All right. If this doesn't work, if we don't get a quest completed here, I'm done. Maybe maybe you have to be in the area during the first set of fires in order for the quest to complete, the daily to complete. I, I don't know. I don't know how it works, but um This just seems so janky. It just seems so ass. Well that that's one of the quests completed. We did our own individual thing. Stop the fires and no, 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 fire training. Well done, Telby. Children take a good look at this shaman. Grow strong and brave like him, and one day you too will fight for the horde. Yay, yippee, woohoo. Okay, but can you like can we fix the game, please? So let's just try it now. Here, let's keep helping our... Let's keep throwing the water buckets. We'll have like a little assembly line. Looks like everyone's getting ready. This quest might be fried too, honestly. If this quest is fried, we're going straight to Deep Home. Because... Well, we'll check out the Undercity one and then we'll go straight to Deep Home. Because, I mean, this is so ass. This is so ass. But, I mean, we did see, like, the animation of all the fires going away. So, I mean, there is, like, something. Like, it does end up completing, you know? Oh, and then here we go. And this is where he starts firing off at you. But, um, yeah, and maybe, maybe we arrived a little bit too late, maybe? That's maybe why, um... That's maybe why um, it didn't complete it for us, maybe?
Maybe. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. If this doesn't work... Why why am I paying $15 for this shit? You know what I'm saying? Like, if this doesn't work, what the fuck, man? And then, and then literally... And I'm not even kidding you guys. That uh, It took them a week to fix Brewfest. No one touched... No developer fixed Brewfest until a week later. It's like... Bro. You got people who pay money, good money to you guys. And you're treating them like... like Cringe on main. Blizzard is just cringe. Like, how can you do that to us, guys? Right, well, look at these people. We're trying, man. We're trying to play the game. We're doing everything we can. You know? Help us out. Alright, it looks like the fires are going down just a little bit, I think. Oh, shoot. But it should be like a, um, there should be no fires, you know, symbolizing that the quest should be completed, right? Indicating that the quest should be completed. As in, you stop the fires. You know, put out the fires. Should be. Yo, there's a bat carrying a bucket? Yeah, that's crazy. Okay, so he's talking about retiring. Maybe that means that the quest is almost complete. Maybe... This is just jank af though. Like, look at this, guys. We're all working together. This is what it's all about, guys. And then they freaking disappoint us with quests that don't even work. Dude, am I in a private server right now? Dude, seriously. Are we in a private server? What's going on? My flames have died. Let not a spark. Okay. Send you myself to the okay. Dark. Okay. Alright, at least this one works. At least this one works. The fires are out. You and your fire brigade were victorious. Ah! The Headless Horseman's attack has failed, but until... Uh, he and his head are destroyed together, he will return. Until then, however, let's take comfort in the safety you brought our children. I am honored to have watched your brave work today. Okay. Okay, what's this? Oh, what's this? You are freed, you're freed from the, uh, you freed the village from the Headless Horseman. Bonus to agility, strength, and intellect. Dude, and we're like floating. Hollow, hollows and candy. Woo. Oh, what the heck? And then now there's a pumpkin here. What is this? Smash the pumpkin. This large jack o' lantern rests in the middle of the village. If it, it eyes those who look upon it, betraying a dark menace within. Smashing the pumpkin reveals an old scorched symbol. Bring the symbol to the orphan. Smash the pumpkin. Be safe. You found this inside the Headless Horseman's jack-o'-lantern? It is an old symbol of the light. It must have been the Horseman's before he was cursed and turned into the monster he is today. Uh, thank you, L.O.B. This symbol deserves to be with paladins. I will make sure they get it. Oh, and I almost forgot. You have a secret admirer? One of the children wanted you to have this. She was too shy to give it to you herself. Oh, that's sweet. Thanks, guy. Or, thanks, pretty pretty lady. Young lady. Appreciate the, um... Oh, and we got the, we got the, um, the pumpkin head on us. Oh, yeah, this is, this is fire right here. What's in here? We got, uh, some more jack-o'-lanterns and then handful of treats. Okay. That's nice. Oh, we can only use the pumpkin head once and lasts for an hour. Uh, nerds makes you look more intelligent. You may not be smarter, but you look it. And we have like a light bulb above our head. Oh, this is kind of fire. If we get on our mount, will the effect remain? I hope so. Alright, well, 
we managed to do a couple of Hollow's End quests. Unfortunately, you know, I'm actually not surprised, but this thing is just bugged. It's just bugged. It doesn't work. Um, but for the, you know, you know, just to keep the Hollow Spirit, Halloween Spirit up, let's go do the final Hollow's Eve, Hollow's End quest, which makes us, which um, tells us to go to Undercity. So we're gonna go to the Undercity. Uh, I'm gonna check one more time to see if this quest is will work, but I doubt it because there's no one who works on this game. But let's check. Let's just check, just in case. Maybe there there might be. And then I'm thinking we do another Headless Horseman quest because if we can get 365 item levels, items, we might we might uh just spam this for a little bit. Oh shoot, my Maple Story premiere is starting. Oh, let me mute it for you guys. Guys, go check out my Maple Story Worlds video. Um I think it's a banger. I think it's great. I think it's a good video. Let me know if you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you guys thought it was meh or eh. Yeah, this quest. Yeah, why did I even try? Why did I even try? It's still bugged. Alright, I'll see you guys at the Undercity, alright guys? What the fudge, bro? Dude, why am I here right now, bro? Oh my god, I'm so fried right now. Why am I here? I hate my life. I hate my life. Alright, hold on, guys. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys at the actual Undercity. What the fudge, bro? Oh my god, dude, I'm so cooked. I thought I got on the right one. I got on the wrong one, guys. I'm such a stupid, stupid man. Whoa, guys. Okay, guys, we're here in the Undercity. I was gonna uh, not come back here at this moment, but look at this. This is the Wicker Man? Oh my god, it's like the Burning Man thing. Holy moly. This looks epic. That's sweet. Okay, this is sweet, man. We're definitely gonna have to get the thumbnail here. Holy crap, that's awesome. What is it? Oh wow, and she actually gives a whole bunch of quests. Welcome to the Wicker Man Festival, Shaman. On the observance of Hollow's End, the Forsaken burn a Wicker Man in honor of this. The most revered of occasions. It was on this day that the Banshee Queen, Sylvanas, herself delivered us from the clutches of the Lich King and the Scourge. We have remained free ever since. Those who would have seen us fall are repaid in full with vengeance. When the Wicked Man is burning, paint your face with the ashes scattered below if you want to celebrate in style. The Wicker Man ceremony is a time-honored tradition. It is good to see the Horde joining us in celebration. A time to build up. We burn the effigy of the Wicker Man as a symbol of our struggle against those who would oppose us. We wear the ashes of the burnt Wicker Man as a symbol of our never-ending fight against those who would enslave us. Use the bonfire nearby and ignite the Wicker Man. Then take the ashes that lay nearby and spread them across your face. These gestures will serve as a reminder to our enemies that we shall never yield. Facts, okay. You know, you, got, you always gotta, you know, support freedom. Okay, guys. A time to break down. Well, Med Shaman, as we revel in the Wicker Man ceremony, it comes as no surprise that the Alliance would attempt to ruin our celebration. We have an opportunity to make them pay for. Uh, if you're interested, Shaman, take this dowsing agent and use it on the Alliance Wicker Man in front of Stormwind. What? Extinguish their flame and revel in their misery. Yo, we gotta go all the way to Stormwind. Oh, sheesh. Yo, dude, why is dude keep on yelling in my ear, man? Frick off. Alright, how do we use the Wicker Man ashes? Do we just click this? Oh, and then that, that's it. You have painted your face with the Wicker Man's ashes. Increases experience earned and reputation gained by 10%? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot to read it. My bad, guys. What's this daily, though? Oh, look at this guy. What is this trick or tricky treat? Oh, dude, we don't we can, we shouldn't be eating these. Oh, frick! Oh, yo, magic brew. Oh yeah, we cannot be eating these. What am I doing? I ate this. Okay, oh, yeah, we cannot eat these. 
It doesn't like count as to show up as a currency. It's like an actual candy. I'm gonna miss out on a lot of trick or treating. Hollows and treats for spoops. Uh, I want you to. I want to keep trick or treating, but I can't because the matron won't let me. If you go for me, I trade you the candy you get for some I already have. I think you'd like this candy. It makes you turn into things both funny and scary. Each of the innkeepers in big cities have candy they give for Hollow's End. For Hollow's End, talk to them and do the tricks they ask for you. Ask for. Also, a troll named Callie Remick in Ogremar is handing out candy as well. When you have all the candy, bring them back to me here. Okay. Jesus Christ, we gotta go to a lot of places. Ogremar, Darkspear, Undercity, and then Thunder Bluff. Oh, that's not too bad. Candice Fenlo. St uh, powerful magic fills the air this season. On Mask Vendor? Whoa! Oh, but it's only limited to Hollow's End. Oh, that's kind of lame. I mean, I like it. But I wish it was like... Um, not just that. Not just limited to that. Wand Vendor? Oh, this is kind of cool. Pirate, Ninja, Ghost, Leopard Gnome, Bat, Skeleton. We have one, right? We had a wand, right? Or no, we don't. Stink bombs away. The foolish alliance have employed hags to fuel an attack on our city. Well, as my sister once told me, turn about is fair play. We will gladly return the favor. Speak with my sister, and she will provide you with a broomstick flight over Stormwind. While over Stormwind, drop stink bombs, stink bombs on the city and on the people. Make them suffer. We will show those hags in Stormwind who is most powerful. Only two trick or treat, tricky treats. Embrace the shadow. Uh, clean up in Undercity. Greetings, Shaman. Are you enjoying Hollow's End? It seems that in response to our stink bombing Stormwind, the Alliance has decided to stink bomb our city. Fortunately, we have magic that can handle the stink the Alliance bring us. Use the arcane cleanser to remove the stink bombs from the city. Remember Within the Undercity. Stink bombs removed? Dude, this is sick, man. The freaking giant wicker man? Dude, that's insane, bro. That's freaking gas, bro. You need to be in the Undercity. So they... It's like actually in the inside the Undercity. We have to do that. Throw at the Wicker Man in Elwyn Forest to unleash a chemical reaction? Okay, not that one. Dude, I should not have eaten my Tricky Treat, man. I gotta save these Mamma Jammas. We gotta save these- Oh, there's a big pumpkin here! Oh, this is awesome, guys. This is awesome! It was just such a buzzkill in the beginning of the video because the quest bugs. It's bugs. Oh, and then you do get the Headless Horseman mount from the, um, I'm pretty sure from the, uh, the, the, the dungeon. We're gonna queue up for a dungeon, by the way. If we can get some, you know, good items, taking that, you know, this is a good item for us. Hit rating and haste. Hit rating, not so much, but haste is good. Intellect, stamina. Uh, we got a daily here from Eunice Birch. I think that's the, that's the cooking daily. Uh, let's go to this one, though. The candy bucket. We can get some tricky treats. Hopefully. Uh, what is the Undercity mint? Chicken clucking, chicken clucking for a mint. Ah, trick or treating on behalf of a child, are we? I was going to say you were a little old to be rummaging about for candies. Well, for my treat, an Undercity Mint, you will need to cluck like a chicken. Yes, chickens love mints. Well, okay, maybe they don't love them, but I won't give you a mint unless you chicken cluck for me. Well, Shaman, are you up to the challenge or not? Time to earn your treat. I mean, I guess. Chicken? We got a freaking chicken over here. Buck, 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 <laughs> That's cute. Hello. Too funny. Well done, Hellaby. Here's your treat. Happy Hollow's End. Oh, let's join. Another quest? Oh, we just do more. Give me those tricky treats, baby. Where's my um, handful of... Here it is. Ooh, three tricky treats! Penny pouch, one slot bag. What the fudge? Yo, what kind of what kind of crap is that? All right, here's another. Um, here's another one, guys. Here's another one. 
Um, because maybe we can get like some, hold on, let me actually Google what items you can get from Headless Horseman. Headless Horseman drops cataclysm. What doth he droppeth? Ring, he drops a bunch of rings. He actually drops the broom. He drops the blade. Okay, so he- oh, I need to be- I need to be fighting, guys. My bad. Oh my god, I don't even have my buffs up, dude. I'm goofing up. So it's actually good to just do this, you know, without getting the daily reward. You can just, uh, get some items. I think he drops a mount, actually. So that- that's pretty, uh, awesome. Uh, did we, um, lust here? Does no one have lust? No one has lust? Uh, we're already cooking. Might as well just not lust. So I didn't realize we have to save those tricky treats. We gotta save them. We need 150 for the magic broom. Actually, I think, I think, uh, now the magic broom doesn't drop from him, right? It probably should just be from the candy vendor. From what we saw uh, in Undercity. Cause that wouldn't make sense, right? If the if the Undercity person um, gives you the magic broom and also the Headless Horseman drops it, doesn't really make sense. So it's probably um, probably just the um, the vendor. Yeah, and this just gives us rings. Uh, I'm gonna need this finger. Yeah. Yeah, so we got we got a bunch of rings. Oh, and this that is Sir Thomas. Okay, so we we already got we're we're ringed out, baby. So we got this one, and then we got this. See, this one's a little bit better. Critical strike. Actually, I don't know. Cause like we don't need hit rating. Our hit chance is already oh our hit chance is booty cheeks. But I mean we got some good eye level now. We're three nineteen eye level. That's solid. Um, okay, let's, uh, we already got the tricky treats from there. We can just go through each freaking, just have like a world tour of like going through all of the cities where they have innkeepers and just, oh shoot, and just, um, getting, uh, doing trick or treat, you know? So, what is this? Stink bombs removed? I don't even think there's any stink bombs here. Yeah, where's the stink bombs? Hmm, I don't know. Because they said that Alliance had to be doing it. So I think it's like a thing where it's like an actual Alliance player has to like come here and drop stink bombs off. And I don't, I'm not playing in a server that has Alliance people in it. So, I mean, there are Alliance people here, but oh, here's a stink bomb, I think, right? Oh, it is, it is. So we have to find these like orange gases. Oh my god. It scared me. I was like, what the heck is that noise? Um, but I don't see any alliance players. Oh, I see one right there. You guys see it? Oh my god, there's a bunch. There's a bunch. Oh, there's a bunch here. Okay, no, we got them. We got them. I was like worried that it might be another bugged quest, but no, we're good. So we gotta remove the stink, the poo poo gas, and after that we gotta, uh, you know, we gotta unleash our our um, we gotta unleash the freaking Taco Bell Chipotle uh, fart gas on them. So uh, that should be a vibe. That should be a vibe. And then how many candies do we get? I forget. Three candies! Not bad, not bad. We're gonna have to be farming a lot, guys. I'm gonna be doing a lot of dailies, doing a lot of, uh... Um... Hollow's Eve dailies off camera, just so we can get that magic broom. Just so we can get the, um... The companions. It's, uh, it's gonna be great stuff, guys. It's gonna be great stuff. Oh, there's one right here. Maybe we could sneak it right here. Oh, no, we gotta drop down. Okay. 
Oh, oh my god. They're, oh, the stink bombs are like everywhere. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it, baby. Oh, this is great, guys. This is great. I just wish that first quest wasn't bugged. That just kind of buzz killed, man. Kind of just killed the vibes, you know? Like, it's lame, man. So, what's the, um... Uh, this one. Speak to Krina Fenlo and take the take a broomstick. Who was Krina? Was that the person that we were just talking to? It's not the flight master here, right? It's Michael. Yeah, no. I think it is the individual that gave us the quest. I think. Okay, but I mean, Hollow's Eve, Hollow's End. It's you know, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. I'm having a great time. Hopefully, if you guys are uh, in classic or in retail, hopefully you guys are enjoying Hollow's End. Um, I gotta say, it's it's pretty good. Aside from the very obvious freaking bug where you're not even able to complete the quest, um, everything else has been doable. It's been great. The vibes have been very spooky, very, you know, Halloween-y. It's, um, it's, it's honestly amazing. It's honestly great, guys. It, it honestly is great. Like, I'm not trying to, like, you know, overhype it or whatever. But, like, if you're into this, like, you know, role-playing kind of vibe, like, dude, it's going to be great for you. It's going to be great for you. You're going to have a great time. And, and I'm into that, too, you know, so. Uh, let's go. Uh, clean up the Undercity. I didn't notice a smell before, but I've come to expect weak magic from those alliance hags. However, the orc guards complained enough, and I will surely and and, and will surely appreciate your efforts. Um, those some use. Okay, so who do we have to talk to? Speak with Krina Fenlo. Okay, where's Krina? Oh, look at these guys. They got like big freaking tiki masks. So adorable. It's so adorable. Where's Krina? I'm gonna have to Google this. Because there's no like X. There's no like mark. Oh my god. Yo, who fried these guys? Oh, hell no. Is it the Alliance? Uh oh. Uh oh. Um, do do do. Speak with my sister and she will provide you with a broomstick. Wall over Stormwind, drop Sting Bomb, make sure you. Okay, but where's your sister at? Where's your sister, though? Oh, she's right here. I'm listening. I'm ready to attack Stormwind. Watch over you. Oh my god, are we really. Okay, I was like, dude, are we about to fly all the way over there? Uh, we have to drop some poop bombs. Whee! Okay, we have to just drop a bunch of stink bombs here. Oh, let's go. Do we actually see people? Like, oh, there's actual people here. We're actually, like, in Stormwind. Oh, my God, look at this. We're actually in Stormwind. Oh, my God, this is amazing. We're stinking up the place. Dude, I can't... Oh, my God, yo, Stormwind got cooked by Deathwing. Holy crap. Dude, this is amazing. This is amazing. Oh, my God. I love this. I love it. Now we have to individually, we have to go by ourselves to Stormwind to drop off a, uh, an, an, another, we have to burn their wicker man, right? Dude, how is that even gonna be possible? Like for real, like we're gonna be, we're gonna get attacked on site. Well, I guess we're in a PVE server, so maybe we, we won't, but um, Oh, we need the Undercity Mint for the dailies. I see. Oh, uh, what is this? Douse the Alliance Wickerman in front of Stormwind? This gives us only three treats? That kind of sucks. But, um, okay. This is really dope, man. This is really dope. So we're just letting the Alliance know the Horde's here. We're stinking up the place. So they're gonna go home all smelly. The Wicker Man might be a different story, though. It might be a little bit more difficult. Okay, and then it just resets. Okay, and then we're good. We can return back home. Oh. Is this thing on park right now? Okay, now we're good. 
We're good. Yeah, 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 we got it, yeah. You're freaking angry, you know. That will show the fools in the Alliance who was the strongest. Take these treats and treat yourself to something nice, Shaman. Okay, I will. I will. Where's Stormwind? Oh, it's so far, guys. Uh, we probably have to go. It's probably best to go to the, the Blasted Lands and then make our way there. Um, let's do that. So, let's first go back to Ogremar because we have to... Um, we got to get the treats from Ogremar, Dark Spear, and Thunder Bluff. And then I think we're going to do the Alliance Wicker Man quest last. Do a flex. All right, we got to... Oh, I should have read it. My bad. We got to flex, though. So let's flex. We'll get the Nougat. You are truly mighty. Well done, and thanks for being such a good sport. Uh, here's your candy. So we got the Nougat here. Uh, how many candies do we have? We have 19 candies. We're popping off, kind of. We're popping off, kind of. Um, what's the... Th oh, the thumbnail's gotta be in front of Undercity. Obviously, man. That is such a great, um, thumbnail. Um, Dark Spear. But the thing is, we didn't get the, um... We didn't get the Innkeeper's Tricky Treats at, um, Razor Hill. So let's do that. Uh, I gotta use the bathroom real quick. Oh, no, it's right here. The Dark Spear is right here. Didn't even know that. Didn't even know that. Oh, I gotta use the bathroom real quick. Give me one sec, guys. Alright, guys, I'm back. Your boy had to freaking release the freaking crack in a part of the motherfucker. Holy crap, so, uh... I'm ready to freaking game, alright, guys? I'm ready to game. It's almost 5 p.m., we're still playing WoW, guys. Uh, we're going to after um, after this. I gotta make another video. We're making a Maple Story Worlds video of us doing our tale Maple Story. <clears throat> the vibes are just they're just they're just amazing right now. The vibes right now are just amazing. Do a train emote. All right. Slash train. That's an emote. Oh, it's like a choo-choo train. Okay. Give me the candy. Oh, I forgot to read the quest. A trick-or-treater? Yaman. Yeah, well, now, even though you're doing something noble and collecting candies for a child, I can't let you off the hook that easily. I have a yummy dark spear gun drop to give to a child. If you make a train noise for me, haha, <laughs> yes, that'll be the trick. The price of this gum drop is one train noise. Chugga chugga shaman. We might as well do it again, right? So you can just do this like unlimited amount of times it seems. So you can just rack up all of these candies and then just uh, not have to go through each city. Oh no, no you, no you can't. Okay, I was about to say, I thought you could just like rack up all the candies and then just like, um, you know, do all of the dailies. Um, or like not have to like technically not have to do all the dailies. Um, you can just have all of the items already available, but nope, you have to, they only give you a one. It's all, it's a unique item, so. Now, we go to, where do we go to? Where are we going? We're going to Thunder Bluff. But before we go to Thunder Bluff, I want to get the, uh, Trick or Treat. I want to Trick or Treat at the, um, Razor Hill, um, Innkeeper. Because we gotta we gotta get these candies, boys. We need 150 candies for the mount, and then another 150 for the black cat. And yeah, I'm trying to get both of them, boys. We trying to get both them mamma jammas. You know what I'm saying? We trying to get both them mamma jammas. And then we're gonna go to Stormwind. I mean, we're gonna go to yeah, we're gonna go to Stormwind. We're gonna um we're gonna mess up their wicker man, and then we'll do a couple of deep home quests. We'll end the video, and I gotta get ready for Maple Story. Douse the Alliance Wicker Man. Only for three tricky treats? Like, that is... That is kind of not a lot. I'm putting my life on the line, man. Like, you know? I'm putting my flipping life on the line. <clears throat> I'm putting my life on the line. 
Oh, we got a cool cosmetic. We're a wisp. Can we get on our mount though as a wisp? Oh, we can't mount while shape shifted. Uh, yo, lame. Yo, lame. Bruh. Bruh. This is sick, guys. We're a freaking wisp. Look at us, guys. Man, this is some BS. This is some freaking some horse dung. Can we go to Thunder Bluff? Can't take it while shape shifted. I love it. I love it. Um, let's go to the crossroads. Let's go to the crossroads because we're gonna need to get a uh, hundred and twenty. Eight more tokens, so we might as well just start today. Oh, are these um, Halloween buckets dailies, or is it just like a one-time thing? I don't know, guys. I don't know. Let's try another headless horseman because he should drop a sword. We can't use swords, actually. <clears throat> Um. Uh, this year's headless one will drop 365 item level. Oh, this is in 2011. 2011. Jesus Christ. Where do I find the comments from this year? Filter with the newest. No one commented on this this year. Um. So as far as I'm concerned, he only drops rings and we already got two rings, so I think we're good. Uh, let me ask. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to look in this looking for group chat. This thing is so cursed. Well, we're not in Ogremar anymore, but when we're in like a big city, I'll ask what the headless horseman drops. Let's leave Q. Let's leave Q. We already did two headless horseman dungeon runs. You guys seen enough, so we're good there. I'm gonna go pick up some uh, trick or treat candies from the crossroads. We'll go over to Thunder Bluff. We'll return this quest. We have to go back to the Undercity, but we're going to start by going from the Badlands to Stormwind. We're going to douse the uh, Wicker Man, and then we'll head back to Undercity. Complete all of the Hallow's End quests, and head over to Deep Home. Do maybe like 10, 10 quests, maybe. Okay. Okay. So there's a candy bucket. It's not like a uh, blue exclamation point, so it's making me think that it's just like a single thing. It's like a one-time thing and then it's done. But maybe it's uh, more than that, I don't know. Uh, okay, let's just fly our way to Thunder Bluffy. We'll get the candy from whoever we're supposed to get it from, as well as getting the trick-or-treat candy. What are we at, 24? And then we'll go back to Ogremar. I gotta ask um, if there's like a mount that drops. We do have a plate user character. I have my Holy Paladin. We could, you know, we could use that for our transmogrifier. But um, I think we have to equip it, right? So how does that work? I don't know. <clears throat> but I'm pretty sure you can only get the mount from the daily reward, I think. Someone let me know if I'm wrong. Someone let me know if it just drops from him. But um, I think that it's just from the daily that you get the Headless Horseman's steed or whatever. His, his uh, horse. Which, uh, that's something I got my eyes on because it's a ground and it's a flying mount. So that's like... That's pretty neat to me. That's pretty neat. Um, and it actually like looks like a ground mount, but it, it can actually fly. It's, it looks more like a ground mount, but it can fly. 
Oh boy, t this whole entire month or a couple of months is going to be crazy because I'm going to be playing Maple, I'm going to be playing WoW, and we're going to have to edit double videos. Oh boy, it's going to be uh it's going to be a rough one, guys. It's going to be a rough one. So pray for your boy. Like, comment, subscribe. Support the channel. It helps me out. I'm over here freaking grinding my buttocks off. Um, so I would greatly appreciate it if you know you liked, comment, and subscribed. Shout out to all my ghost watchers. Thank you so much for watching and not saying anything because you're a ghost. I appreciate you. Okay, we're here at the Sanda Bluff. Let's go and get the tricky candy. And we'll get the daily candy as well. We'll get the daily candy as well. Well met. Well met. What do we get from here? Three! Nice. Oh, we can turn someone to a skeleton. Oh, and look at this. We're a little bat. Oh, this is so cute. Dude, I love this, man. I love this. I just hate how we can't fly without uh, breaking the shapeshift. It's annoying. So we got to dance. Slash dance. Oh, whoops. Slash dance. I may have 99 problems, but dancing ain't one of them. Happy Hallow's End. Oh, I forget to, I'm always forgetting to read it. <clears throat> I'm always forgetting to read it. Even though you're trick-or-treating on behalf of a child, you still need to perform a trick for the treat. You can't very well change the tradition now, can we? I believe the cost of a piece of marzipan nowadays is to bust out and dance. That's right, let me see your moves. Dance for me, and I'll give you some tasty marzipan. Goodbye. Okay, we did it though. All right, um, now we can go to Blasted Lands, right? Yes, now... Oh, this, um, we already did it. Uh, now we go to Blasted Lands. Oh, we can go to the Blasted Lands from here. Yeah, we gotta get rid of our shapeshift, which I don't like. I'm not the biggest fan of that. I wanna be, I wanna stay a bat, you know? I'm, I'm feeling batty right now. I would like to remain that way, but unfortunately, the technology just wasn't there. The technology just wasn't there. Alright, so we gotta go screw over the Wicker Man's thing in Stormwind, so let's do that. Um, Where is the nearest flight path? Is it at Sunvale? I think so. Um, ooh, there should be a, um, a candy here, right? Maybe? Maybe. <clears throat> ah, da, 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 da. Actually, I don't think there's a innkeeper here, but maybe there's a candy bar here, maybe. <clears throat> uh, nope, not seeing it. Uh, there should be a candy bar actually at, um, the, the Dude Mall post, or the Dread Mall hold, right? 100%. There should be an innkeeper there, right? Uh, I'm gonna go just grab up the candies as I'm, like, kind of moving towards Stormwind. But, uh, we gotta go get, go to Stormwind, which is, uh, not too far from here. We have to go to Swamp of Sorrow. Stone Arch should definitely have a candy thing there. We have to go to Darkshire. No uh, uh, horde stuff there. And then we actually, actually, we. Oh, and no, this is Red Ridge. Uh, I was thinking it was like the um, the Burning Steps. Maybe we could have gotten a um, a candy here. But it's gonna take a little bit too long. So. We'll just get our candy from Stoneard and Dreadmall Hold, and then we'll, um, we'll uh, mess up the Alliance Wicker Man. There should be a candy here, right? Yeah, they got the pumpkins here. They got all, they're all pumpkined out. Is there no innkeeper here? There's a blacksmither right here. We have Thorium. 
There we go. We got the candy bucket right here. Here we go. Let's go. And we get what you get 20 gold just for doing this, guys. Insane. <clears throat> we got two here. That's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. Oh, we can't use it on ourselves. What? What? That's no fun, man. All right, let me go to Stonard, and then we'll make our way to uh, outside of Stormwind. Hopefully, we don't get assassinated by some freaking allies. All right, Stonard. Candy bucket. Candy bucket. That's what we're looking for. That's what we need. Dude, uh, I don't want to get rid of these costumes, man. It's... Uh... Like, this is so amazing. Why do we have to get rid of this? I don't like it. So you can't. Oh, we can't. Oh! Oh! Oh, this is a costume. It's not a shapeshift. So we can actually remain as the uh, the gnome here. The pirate gnome. And this will be a great disguise when we're going into Stormwind. They'll think we're just, uh, you know, a little wee gnome. Just going to, you know... The capital city but all right guys i'll see you guys once we're outside of stormwind let's go all right guys we're approaching the outside of stormwind city oh are these the guys that we have to burn is this it you're mounted Requires Alliance Wicker Man? Oh. Um. Dude, yeah, this quest literally is telling you, basically, go freaking... Go fight the entire Alliance. It's like, bro. You can't even use this while mounted. You gotta drop down, get off your mount, and hope and pray that an Alliance does not come and freaking kill you on sight, dude. Um. Where's the Wicker Man? Oh, it's right here. Oh, silly, silly me. Dousing Asian. Wicker Man Reveler. The bells have told. Shelter your weak, your young, and your old. Each of you shall pay the final sum. Cry for mercy. The reckoning oh. has come. Okay, well that wasn't so bad. Um, I think that's it. I think that's all the quests, all of the the the, the Hollow's End quests. We we're, we weren't able to do the missing heirlooms quest because the freaking thing is bugged. But um, we managed to do everything else. Let's uh let's turn them in now. We have to go to Undercity now. So let's go to Undercity, turn in all the quests. Um, I don't think we could fly there. I don't think we have a flight path. There, so we're gonna have to take the uh, Zeppelin. <clears throat> we're gonna have to take the Zeppelin for show skis. For show skis. Um, I might have to hit like a dungeon or something, because if we got like the two hour buff, 10% reputation gain, we could very easily get our 359 boots from Earthen Ring. Um, I might have to do a couple of dungeones, potentially. Uh, okay, wait, we have to go to Undercity, right? It's not anywhere else. I'm not tripping. Oh, wait, over here. Yeah, it's these, it's here, okay. Okay. Let's go to Deep Home after this, guys. Video's not over yet. I wanted to show you guys all of the Hollow's End quests, um, and then we're gonna get back into regular questing content. Cause you know I wanna the video, the title of the video is gonna be uh, you know celebrating Hollow Halloween and World of Warcraft or whatever. So I want to show you guys that you know I don't want to just like half-ass it and like you know just like make like a two-minute video. No, I want to show you guys like exactly like how to do everything, what everything in entails. 
you know, um, ha like what it consists of and not like just, you know, you know, just make like a half-baked video and it, obviously it's, it, you know, and unfortunately it, it's gonna, it, it, this video is like already like an hour, 40 minutes long, but, um, I mean, that's what it, that's what it takes. That's what it takes. We're showing it, we're showing it you guys here right now, but, um, yeah, I'll meet you guys back in Undercity. Okay, we are back in good old Undercity. Let's go. Let's turn in these quests and let's head to Deep Home afterwards. We'll get like a couple of quests in and then we're going to end to Dai's video. And if you guys are wondering why we're going to Deep Home, that's where we left off, last left off in our cataclysmic journey. So um, that's where we're going to continue. Have you finished trick-or-treating yet? The matron said we could pick one place to visit. At least there is a lot happening here. Ooh, 10 candies. Wow, you got them all. You're awesome. Thank you for trick-or-treating with me. Here, take these pumpkin treats. I think you'll like them a lot. Oh, I, I am gonna like them after we can get this freaking uh, magic broomstick. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. You can get the... um. We have this. You can get we can you can you can get these items from um, the daily bag. So maybe we don't even need to spend these after all. A little wicker man. Oh, dude, we gotta get this. We gotta get the feline familiar and the the uh, the wicker man as well as the magic broom. You know, we we gotta get all of these mamma jammas. Oh, and this obviously too. We got a little companion, another companion. Oh, bro, we're we're gonna have a freaking field day here. Ah, so it is done. A momentary setback, but if it is as annoying as their attacks have been, then it is worth it. The children learned about your adventure and were very excited. They seemed to revel in the mayhem that you helped bring about. Oh, those little rascals. They did want you to have some of these treats as a reward. Enjoy, LLB. Oh, thanks. Rotten Hollow! Ruin Hollow's end for the Alliance and foil their attempts to wreck the Horde celebration by completing the following quests. Okay, we got an achievement for that. Yo, fire. Alright, let's go to the Brill real quick, because the Brill will definitely have a uh, trick-or-treat candy box, candy loot box. We're at 45 candies already, my friends. We needed a total of 450 to get all three of the companions. Um, 600 to get... Uh, the mount uh, That's honestly a shit ton of candies <laughs> But um, you know what I'm I'm ready for it, baby. I'm ready Freddy. Oh my god. We're a little cat now We're a little cat now I love it man, I love it dude this is so amazing. Oh, we gotta take the thumbnail outside of, uh, inside the Undercity. I forgot to take a thumbnail. We'll take a thumbnail as the cat, dude. This is like, amazing. I'm not gonna lie. Everything was amazing. Except for the stupid bugs quest, this one right here. Everything was amazing except for that. Like, the vibes were there feels like oh we only we're only it for a little bit it, it just felt so halloween you know if we fight the headless horseman there's a dungeon you fight the headless horseman you get a little pumpkin hat like it's uh this is a great event guys you guys definitely want to be logged in and doing your dailies for this especially if you don't have 372 378 item level items and you need to increase your eye level because you can get some nice rings from the Headless Horseman dungeon. Um, so yeah, you guys definitely want to uh, be logged in. It's such a great event. Like you guys definitely want to like read the quest dialogues too. They're not that like detailed and like lore heavy, but they do have some stories in them. So it's uh, it's pretty cool. We're gonna get the uh, the Jack O' Lantern helmet. Now, let me take off the mask. There we go. Okay, yeah, this is a great shot right here. What do you guys think? Thumbnail worthy or no? It's gonna be the thumbnail anyways. It's not, this video is not live. Ooh, so good, so good. It's so Halloween-y. 
so Halloweeny. I love it. I love the spooky season, guys. This is amazing. This is amazing. All right, guys. Let's go to Deep Home. Let's quest for just a little bit. And then, um, let me see what the Torrin female mask. Uh, that's a Torrin female? Dude, why is my nose huge, dude? Holy crap. All right, um, I think that's it for Hollow's End, right? This is, we could just abandon this. This is the candy. Um, yeah, I think that's it for Hollow's End. So let's go back to Deep Home, continue where we left off in Deep Home. So pretty much, guys, what's happening in Deep Home, the world pillar shattered because Deathwing came through here, through to Deep Home. And he ended up breaking the world pillar. We need to repair the world pillar so that Deep Home does not crack, collide into... Hold on, I don't want to hear this guy in my ear. So that Deep Home does not collide into Azeroth, in turn destroying it. So that's, I believe, the story. That's what's going on here. Um, so let's continue. We are just right now um, helping the Earthen Ring uh, fix the pillar of the world, and we're going to continue. We'll do a couple of quests because I gotta get Maple Story in. I don't want to start editing both videos at like 9 p.m. So you know I want to try to. Um, you know, not die tonight. Uh, that would be very helpful. Uh, so, yeah. Um, uh, Deep Home. Alright, we're back, guys. We're back. We're back. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that Hollow's End segment. If you guys did, uh, if you guys could like, comment, subscribe, I would greatly appreciate it. Helps the channel out a lot. Um, helps me out a lot. So what is this? This is for helping that dude's son, or the the son, right? Or oh no, this is we got to defeat the Twilight Hammers guy at the Master's Gate. This is uh, and this is for the son, right? Oh, the son wants us to to defeat the Trogs, right? think oh we got to turn on NPC names um, I don't know let's just start with the master's gate yes yeah, soften them up trog dweller how come it's not being shown oh cause we have too many quests tracked oh no it's a oh no this isn't it this is a this is a grim Bethel dungeon what the heck I thought we had to like kill the um the the stone trogs for that um that dude's son. What was his name? What's his name again? I forgot. But um, let's go. We have to like free. Uh, like destroy these like elementals here. I think. Uh, I think we just had to kill them, right? Oh shoot! No, no, no! I think I don't think we have to do that. What the heck? Why? Why don't? Why? Why were my spells all weird there? Do we have to kill these guys? I don't know. He's dying though. Oh, we do. Okay. And what's this? One-time decryption engine? Who the freak is this guy? This guy just popped up. Oh my god, there's another one here. Wait, wait, why can't I see their names? Oh, I forgot to turn on NPC names on, right? Let me just kill this guy really quickly. Yeah, we gotta turn on NPCs. I was like, where are these guys coming from? It's hard to tell. Uh, this. What do we do here? Oh, we gotta just click that. Okay. Alright, so yeah, we're, you know, basically just stopping the Twilight's Hammer. They have uh, access to a Titan Gate. Um, I don't know what they plan on doing with that, but we're gonna eventually figure it out. So we're here, guys. We're here back in Deep Home. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the vibes, enjoying the gameplay. Um, like I said, if you guys are on your, if you guys, um, 
don't have great equipment for your alts or if you guys are just starting and you guys are max level and you want to get some nice rings to give to your character go ahead and hit that headless horseman dungeon if you got everything and you're just kind of hunting for cosmetics hunting for just fun novelty items uh, you can go ahead and just go through each of the inns and collect the candies there and buying all of the uh, cosmetics and the you know the cool uh, knickknacks and stuff so a lot a lot of good things to do here guys if you're um, if you're a WoW player, it's, it's really good. That one quest though is bugged, I will say, which is uh, pretty unfortunate. But um, it's gonna eventually get fixed. Dude, it blizzard. If you don't fix that quest within three days or four, like less than that, man, you guys are fried, bro, honestly. Cause like, dude, it took them a week to fix the, the Brewfest quest. And we got no word from any GM saying, oh, we're working on it, we're fixing it, nothing. It was just, we're just, it was just quiet. Radio silence. And then it just randomly gets fixed with no word letting us know that, oh, it's fixed. It was just like the players had to come and say, oh, guys, it's fixed. So it's just like, they just treat the classic community so badly. The devs treat the classic community so poorly. It's like, bro, just talk to us. Like, just say words, man. Like, you could tell us that it's fixed. Like, it's like, you know, like, you could tell us you did your job, man. Like, it's, it's helpful for us. So we don't have to, like, find out on a random ass time, you know, like. And we could find out through official means as, op as opposed to just like testing it out to see if it works. Like, I don't know what, I don't know what, I don't know why they neglect the classic community so hard. I don't know why. Aha! So that's it. They're planning on invading Uldum. Okay. What's worse is that the pyramid inside the Maker's Rides at Uldum can be reconfigured to become a weapon. A weapon that is capable of destroying all life on Azeroth. Yo, gasp. The wrong sequence. The Twilight's Hammer must be stopped from using the Waygate. There's only one thing to do. Punch in the wrong activation sequence and destroy it. Huh, let's see. Yes, here's one that opens up the explosive depths of the Fire Lance. The Elemental Plane of Fire. That should do nicely. Use the Waygate controller to punch in the wrong activation sequence, thereby destroying the Waygate. Do we get anything good here? Um, no. Alright, we got the air. What else do we need? We need fire. But we're already here in front of the Waygate, so let's let's just screw it up. Let's screw him over. I'm not really seeing like a big damage difference, uh, you know, ever since equipping those rings. Maybe there is, but I just kind of can't really tell. I feel like we've been hitting 18,000 damage crits on our lava burst, you know, before the rings, but... Whoa! My god! Okay, well, that does, that, 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 um, deals with that situation, so they're never going through that thing. So it looks like we just ended up destroying the Titan Way Gate, that's great. So they're not going to be able to invade Uldum, ultimately trying to, you know, cap, you know, amass, like, the power of, like, some super weapon. Um, so that's great. We are putting an end to the Twilight's Hammer's, um, plans, their evil plans, and some good stuff. Oh, is someone fighting this world boss here? I don't know, he's fighting minions, what the heck? What the heck? Oh, we just gotta wait for, okay, he's back. I was like, we gotta wait for the bound elemental to spawn. Oh my, what in the world was that? Okay, now we have to kill a Haven. Haven! Hey, hey, Haven! Yo, I'm so excited to play Maple Worlds, or um, old school Maple Story. Um. I'm pretty hyped, boys. I'm pretty flippin' hyped. Hopefully you guys are excited for my viewers. Is he... Where is this guy? He's gotta be inside here, right? Is that you? Can you get a little, like, sneak, sneaky-beaky look in there? 
So yeah, hopefully you guys are excited because you guys are going to be seeing a lot more Maple Worlds content as well as... Um, where is this guy? As well as uh, WoW. Where is this guy? It says he's like on the bottom of this cliff, but I kind of doubt it. Oh, he's right here. You can see that yellow dot in my mini-map? Okay, well, okay, maybe he is here. Why is he on the bottom of this? Why is he at the bottom here? Shouldn't he be at the base of operations? What? He's not even here. Yeah, homie has to be- Oh, he's on top of this rock! I was like, wait a second, what the heck? Where is this guy? Oh, here, he's, he's yelling. There is an intruder amongst us. Destroy them. and Nothing must interfere with Lord Deathwing's plan. Yeah, he's here. What up, asshole? Oh my god, yo, dude looks menacing af. Alright, it's time to die, you little sucker. You will be destroyed. I don't think so, pal. Oh, we actually pressed the wrong button. I don't think so, pal. My firebolt is useless. No matter, you smug little insect, I will destroy you. Yeah, you got fried, bro. You got fried. Your ass is laid down right now. Okay. Let's go back to the Temple of Earth. And turn in these quests. Hopefully we get Earthen Ring reputation. That's what we're kind of aiming for. Oh, there's a tree tier. Nice. Dun, 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 dun. Makes you look witched. Wicked, I mean. Looking wicked? Oh, it's just like some little cosmetic thing. Alright. Okay, you did it! Excellent work, my boy. You found out what the Twilight's Hammer were up to, and you stopped them dead in their tracks. Examiner Row pats you on the back with his bony hand. Now I'm certain that I have something around here for you. He begins rummaging around for your reward. We'll take the chest piece, we could sell it. Ogremar, what? That pyramid at the Maker's Terrace in Oldham is nothing of the sort. It's a giant machine that can be reconfigured for any number of uses. Deathwing was going to have the Twilight's Hammer turn it into a massive weapon. Hello B, you have to take the portal to get this information to Belloc Brightblade at Gromash Hold in Ogremar. He'll know what to do. Bro. Too soon, bro. Too soon. I gotta stay here in Deep Hole. We gotta do all the quests here first. Time is of the essence. An excellent display of shaman prowess. The reliquary eyes you up and down. Ooh, she's checking out my uh, my feet. She's checking out my feet. I believe that a reward is in order. Something appropriate for a powerful man such as yourself. Oh, yo, is she digging me right now? Yo, is homegirl digging me right now? I think so. Salama Ashalanore. Okay. Ah, Let me sell. So, anything else we could sell? I don't think so. Can we transform this guy? Can't. <clears throat> I think it only says for party members. Yeah, party member. Um, so we could do either gunship or we can help out that um that earthen guy. What was his name? I forgot. But he was the son of one of these powerful earthens who live in Deep Home, who actually has the middle piece of the um of the uh, world pillar. Uh, let's actually just go to the gunship. So, meet Stormcaller Milera aboard the Alliance gunship. Okay, is it like in the air? It is in the air. What the fudge? Bro, why did they shoot us down, bro? We gotta stop Deathwing, man. Yo, Alliance is crazy. And their ship is up and running. So, it's like, it's not like, like we didn't deal damage to them. Like, they just killed us. And they literally killed us. The people who died in the um, the Storm's Fury gunship. I mean, the people who were in the Storm's Fury, gun Fury gunship, they mother effing died, bruh. 
Is Myleira here? Bro, what is going on right now? Oh my god! What happened here? There's no... There's more to this than we know. Hello, B. I can guarantee you that much. Oi! Hello, B. I was told I'd have company soon. All our friends... All my friends are dead. All my friends are dead. Push me to the edge. That's right. Something's wrong here, Hello, B. The ship's crew has been slain. Yet there is no bloodshed or damage to the ship's structure. This was not the Horde's doing. We will find the answers we seek by speaking to the spirits of the dead. They have not yet left this world. That have not- They have not yet left this world. Take this totem and place it near the corpses of the fallen. You will have a few seconds to listen to their last few thoughts. Be- Yo, hell no. Yo, she's gonna- She's gonna get me end up possessed or something like that. I'm gonna end up having- Leaving the- The world- The portal to the spirit world open for too long. Motherfucker's about to fucking- have some real estate in my head after this shit I'm not I, you do it you do it I'm gonna have to do it guys we're gonna have to do it it's unfortunate uh, you will have a few seconds to listen to our last few thoughts beware however there is no telling how the spirits of the dead will react to our prodding exactly that's what I'm saying why are you making me do this freaky deaky type action the admiral's captain a cabin it's possible we'll find further clues inside the admiral's cabin you will find it directly below us. See if there are any supervi uh, su survivors or information that will lead us closer to the World Pillar Fragment. Be careful, Hello B. Whoever got the crew might still be out there. Bruh. Yo, you ain't gonna help me out, Malara? Malara? Sketch. Sketch. Alright, we gotta use this totem here. I heard them praying to their dark gods as everything went black. The Twilight's Hammer did this. Is that enough? Oh, we gotta, we gotta uh, do six. Six members. They poisoned our supplies. We had cultists on board all along. Yo. So the Alliance had a couple of moles in their camp. Uh-oh. Everyone started dropping like flies. Everyone who ate the rations. Twilight scum! You did this to us! Yo, chill, bro. I didn't I'm I'm not I'm I'm not in the Twilight. Yo, dude has like PTSD or something. It wasn't even me. What can you do? They tricked us into ambushing the Horde gunship. But why? So they the the Alliance did end up killing the the Horde. So yeah. I mean freaking Alliance and a bunch of idiots, man. I heard them praying to the dark okay, it just says the same thing. Alright, now we have to go to the, um... Uh, who do we have to go to? Admiral's Cabin. Is it here? Oh, we, we got the Twilight. The Twilights are right here. They're ready to get down. Okay, well, he's ready to get down. More Narok the Hateful. Do we have to go down more? I think we do. Bro, just let me, just let me live, just let me go without any trouble, dude. I just wanna, I just wanna finally have me finish this. I gotta, I gotta make another video after this, right after this. Just let me chill, let me, let me chill. I'm just trying to chill. I'm just trying to chill. You know? Okay, well, we go here. Inside there, probably. Oh, big double lightning bolt to the dome skis. Yeah, dude, I'm feeling. I'm not really feeling the strength from these rings, guys. These rings don't feel like they've been. They be doing a lot for me. Is that just me? Or or, or did they do more for me? I, I don't know. 
I mean, we should have, I mean, intellect gives us damage, so, I mean, we should be doing, we, sh we technically are more powerful, but it just doesn't feel like it. The fudge? Okay, these guys are... This question mark is not right. Ah, ah. Yo, I'm so excited to play Maple Story. I don't even know who to be, bro. Like, I wanted to be an assassin. But then again, I, I don't know who I should be. I don't know. Like, I wanted to be assassin, but I'm kind of leaning towards making a uh, mage. Just because I want to hear Alinea music, dude. Literally. Simply just for that fact. Just so I could listen to the Alinea music. Like, that's how freaking... That's how, like, uh, it's got me, it's got me, guys. It's flipping got me. Like, I just want to feel again. I just want to feel again. Is that too much to ask, Nexon? I just want to be able to feel again. Dude, what am I looking for, bro? God, bro, this is is this not the admiral's cabin, bro? Who the freak am I looking for? Yo, why did this dude spawn so fast? Yo, someone's fighting here. Who is this? Oh, it's a uh, oh, it's a human. How's it going? Oh, I think it's right here. No, what the fudge. Bro, what am I looking for? We gotta look for the Admiral's cabin. I don't- I don't know what- what, what is- Is this not the Admiral's cabin? This looks like a cabin that an Admiral would be at. We got a- we got a little like fancy chair right there. I guess it's not here. I guess it's above- above, um, on the top of the ship. I guess we were there the whole time. We just freaking didn't know it. Oh my god, it's right- it's gotta be right here, right? It's gotta be right here. Oh my god, I'm stupid. Yo, there's someone who's still alive! This ship is filled with rats! Without a captain or crew. Not sure who you're with, but you don't look like one of them. I'm not sure what happened. I slept through supper and woke up to a ship full of dead people and murderers. Not sure if you want to kill me or not, but I'll spare you the trouble. Moody points to a wound in his stomach. His insides are not where they should be. I can keep steering the ship for a while longer. You don't die from a gut wound immediately. Just bring me some rope and some rum. No. Whiskey. <clears throat> bring first mate Moody a bottle of whiskey and a spool of rope. <clears throat> so it looks like there is one singular survivor and it is the captain. Or the first mate. Spool of rope. Yeah, someone's like talking in my ear right now. What the heck is going on? The fudge? Oh, it's Myla, right? Oh, it's that human probably doing the quest. Oh, but here you are, ugly well. All my friends are dead. Push me to the edge. All my friends are dead. Where do we find the alcohol? All my friends are dead. Push me to the edge. Um, I mean, I wish I wish we knew where to find the bottle. Oh, it's right here. Okay. This is the last time, asshole. Okay, I'm tired of you. Just stop being hostile. I'm literally one-shotting you guys. Like, well, I'm not one-shotting. You guys are getting owned by me, okay? Like this. Just stop coming. Stop. Stop trying to start some fights. All right. Stop trying. Stop starting fights. You can't finish. Okay. All right, Malara. Malara. We are bound to run into the Twilight's Hammer sooner or later, Hello B. If they're behind this, it's quite likely that the World Pillar Fragment is in their possession, bro. Those are not the words I want to hear. It looks like the Twilight's Hammer is still on the ship. Go below a dex and take them out. Be careful, Hello B. I have a feeling they're not here for a spiritual retreat. 
if you know what I if you know what I mean. On second thought, take one prisoner. It's it's not too late, Hello B. The cultists are probably still here. Go below decks, find out who's in charge, and subdue them. We will attain answers to our questions one way or another. Okay, we have so many quests that we're tracking that like we don't need to track. Okay, we're good. Alright, that's much better. Our quest tracker really just looks more cleaner. I like. I like what Drake likes. Alright, so we have to kill that ogre in the Mornarok. Mr. Mornarok. Why do we have a question mark? Oh, for the um the captain, right? Or the first mate or whatever his name was. That was a weird pathing. Mr. Mornerock. Well, we're not supposed to kill him, right? We're supposed to just like subdue him. Get him low enough till he um, just, you know, doesn't want to do anything, doesn't want to fight us. Okay, okay, I give up. I'll tell you everything. You better. Don't do it! Yo, Mylara! Over here, ya ugly whale. Oh, and that's what it uh that's what that dialogue was. Oh, that's fun. Let me go now! Meet me back up top. This two headed freak has a few questions to answer. Oh, he definitely does. This guy, this guy. Yo, this guy thought he could put his hands on me. This dude thought he could put hands and feet on me and get away with that shit. Hell nah. Hell nah. Yeah, we had to freaking... We had to get his ass up out of here, honestly. Get his ass up out of here immediately, boys. Immediately. So now that, guys, now that we're going to be double uploading, I don't know how to, um, I don't know what I should do to upload the videos, or how I should upload the videos. Should I make it so it's, like, just playing at the same time, or, like, maybe, like, should I make my WoW video start sooner, like, around, like, um... I usually start them at, like, 3, or at, like, 4 p.m. Maybe I'll start it at, like... 12? Oh, that seems like too early though. Maybe I'll start at like 1 p.m. and then have the Maple Story videos be towards the end segment. Towards like the nighttime, maybe. I don't know. Man, yeah, now that because like yo, we're gonna be working double OT, man. We're working double OT, no breaks, man. Holy crap. It's gonna be uh it's gonna be a um a lot of work, guys. You have what I asked for? Alright, help me get tied to the wheel. Take the plate. For the Alliance. Thanks, this will give us a couple more hours of not running into the rocks. No guarantees after that. That's it? Well met. That's it? First mate Moody? Okay, well let's talk to Mylara. Uh, take no prisoners. Well done, Hello The Twilight Hammer is an evil that we must fight anywhere we find them. Oi, this is a this was a heavy one. He nearly broke me Griffin's back. Are you ready to interrogate the ogre? May the ancestors hop on, Hello B. Let's see what Mr. Ogreface has to say for himself. Don't be shy. Stormbeaks only ever dropped a passenger a couple of times before. Okay, that's not reassuring. Okay, we're gonna get on Stormbeak. And then we have more Narok on our, uh, at our mercy here. 
Oh my god, holy... Holy... Nope, not for evil motherfuckers like you. Hey, got him. Got him. Nope, we're dropping you. All right, never mind. Maybe I'll meet the evil one. Oh, yo, he's ganking mid lane right now. Oh, yo, he, yo, we, we got him in there. Twilight Council? Okay, so, yeah, he got fried. We literally put him to the freaking, uh, the freaking, uh, magic bullet. Send his ass to the Shadow Realm. That was pretty cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Some spraining to do. We have our answers, LLB. Let's report back. Uh, we'll take the axe. Sell it for the most gold. Return to the Temple of Earth. Uh, you must get word back to the others at the temple. <coughs> Excuse me. Chances are the fragment is already getting moved to a more secure location. Tell Marut what you know. I'm going to do a little investigating about this Twilight Council in the meantime. Yo, fire! Yo, that was a kind of a cool quest line. I like that. I like that a lot. I really do. I really did. Element of patience? What the heck? They got elements for patience now? Yo, the WoW team is running out of ideas. They got element they got elements for patience now? Come on, man. Alright, let's go back to the, the let's go to the Temple of the Earth. Let's check it out. Let's uh go back to Marut. Marut. And then I think we'll end today's video because we gotta get started on Maple. It's already 6 p.m. If we're gonna play Maple for like two hours, we're gonna be done at like eight, and you gotta edit. I gotta edit both these videos. I'm gonna be cooked, boys. I'm gonna be cooked, guys. Yo, let me know if you guys are playing Maple Story World. If you guys are waiting for Maple Lands, if you guys are just gonna stick with our tale, let me know what your um, plans are for Maple Worlds. If you guys are even playing it. Uh, let me know because uh, maybe we could potentially, you know, start a B variety server. We could have like a nice little hangout spot for us. For the, you know, the the familia, my friends and family, you know. Marut! I come with, I come bearing good news. Well, good and bad. We must investigate your findings further, but we must not lose track of the fragment. Uh, what is this? Why is this guy? Why is he here? The Twilight's Hammer involvement in the disappearance of the World Pillar fragment makes complete sense. Let us hope that we can act swiftly enough to recover it. Marut places his hand on your shoulder. I have established a spiritual bond with you. We should be able to communicate while you remain in Deep Home. Go to Deathwing's Fall to the southeast and investigate the Twilight's Hammer operation there. Oh, we got a quest from Seer Cormu. Cormo. Hey, and we got that Earthen Ring rep. Nice. Blood of the Earth Warder. When Deathwing escaped to Deep Home, his corruption was extreme, but perhaps not yet absolute. 
The cultists at Deathwing's fall harvest and shape the corrupted blood he left behind into living organisms to draw from their power. What if a trace of the Earth Warder's essence remains? After all, Neltharion was the aspect of Earth before he was the aspect of death. Gather samples from the living blood the cultists have created, and we'll see if any trace of the Earth Warder remains. Um... Okay, but why though? Deathwing's fall? Why is it not showing up? Oh, it's right here actually. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, and this is where Deathwing, I'm assuming, fell. He, I don't know, f like f uh, physically, maybe literally fell to the ground, or maybe that's where he was defeated. I, I don't know. But let's end today's video. Let's end today's video. We got we got a lot of things done today. We got Hollow's End event completed. A little bit of deep poem. Let's end today's video, guys. Okay, my friends. Uh, we are completed with part 42 of the WoW Cataclysm series. Thank you guys so much for sticking through with the series with your boy. Hanging out with me. Watching the vids. If you guys want, you guys can chat in the premieres. I'm always there watching it. So if you guys have any questions or just want to say what's up, I'll say what's up back. Uh, but if you guys could, like, comment, subscribe, I would greatly appreciate it. We're trying to hit 500 subscribers. If we hit 500 subscribers, I'm going to tell you guys my ghost story. Um, and hopefully we can end up giving back. Eventually, once we get bigger, we can start giving back to you guys. Um, because you guys are, you know, awesome. Everyone who watches all that stuff. And I really mean it, because guys... We peaked on our last premiere, or on our two premieres ago, like the um, the end of Hydral video premiere. We peaked at like 25 viewers, dude. 25 unique viewers is insane, bro. That's like the most I've ever gotten, like ever. So, shout out to you guys. Um, so yeah, uh, next video, <clears throat> we're going to continue Deep Home. It looks like we are slowly um, finding and gathering each of these fragments of the world pillar trying to rebuild it uh, also while understanding uh maybe the story about what happened when deathwing was here and when he when he, when he came to deep home um because clearly he's not here right now um he's gone somewhere i don't know he's probably in he's in azeroth freaking burning people alive um but he was here at one point and I, he destroyed the world pillar because he came here and crash landed in here i think that's what the story was uh but we're gonna figure out more of it uh everything will probably make sense when we finish all the quests here in a deep home let me know if you guys are enjoying the series i would greatly appreciate it let me know what you guys' favorite cataclysmic zone is uh for now right now as of now we've only completed fully completed two i'd have to say um hydral is uh the best out of the three that we've um, are doing so far two that we've completed one that we're doing which is deep home um, So let me know what you guys uh, think about that and Guys uh, also we're gonna be getting you guys are gonna be seeing a lot more of me. Okay guys we're, I'm talking double uploads potentially daily guys, which is Gonna be so bad for my health cuz like I'm gonna be up all night editing up all day gaming so, uh, it's gonna be, um, it's gonna be a, a mission for sure, but it's gonna be worth it because as I'm having fun doing this and it's something that I love doing, I, I love being a freaking nerd and just playing games and hopefully you guys enjoy all of that as well. Um, I don't know what I'm saying, but thank you guys again for watching. We're gonna end this video. I'll see you guys tomorrow for more Deep Home. I'll see you guys later. I'm out. Peace!